<laughs> Welcome back to Parks and some Parsimony. We are packing and trying to get ready for our first family vacation. What are you eating? I am in the middle of packing. I have the playpen for Hannah. We are staying at a conference center, so I think most everything should be provided, but I am taking the playpen for Hannah. Just, I think that's probably a good idea to have. I'm also taking her sound machine because she does not sleep without her sound machine. So I'm just working on packing her bag here. A company reached out to me and asked me if I would be interested in taking along with us the, a grooming kit. I had one of these long time ago for one of the kids and I loved loved it so this comes with the items that I'm most excited about little toothbrush and this I probably won't end up using when we're sick but it has combs it has the combs it has the medicine dropper here you can have the dropper or the measuring spoon and then nail clippers a thermometer in case they get sick while they're away they've got a manicure set i mean it has everything you could need while you're traveling so i said absolutely by all means i'd be excited to try it out while we are away so i'm going to make sure that i pack this along with me for those of you who are wondering this is the Asanto brand and i'm just going to throw it in her bag so i have it here i don't expect any of us to need it or to be sick or anything like that it's always good to have it on hand with you so we got to put Hannah's shoes in here and I, I think like eating I think everything will be thank you Grace, ah! or what if Lillian. Lillian. Lillian sorry it's been a long it's been a long day trying oh, yeah. to pack getting ready for going away are you guys excited though mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. no this is a short short trip it's only two nights three days and we're gonna give it a shot we haven't really done any family vacation since camp well not camping um since the family no, since we went to took lillian to michigan. to michigan and that was lillian was 15 months old so <laughs> that would be five years ago so we're gonna try a two night stay it's only a few hours away from here. We'll see how we go. It's gonna be Sunday. We, we will see how it goes. Hopefully I won't lose my mind. And we'll all have a good time, right? Yay! The kids went to the library last night with art and is this your book? Yes! yes. We're gonna we're gonna take this book. We have a whole stash of books we're gonna take for the car trip. Cool. What is that, Mary? It's a light, I think. What do you um, that's weird. I wonder what you use this. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. You got it. Is that to keep the oh. baby happy? Oh, okay. what? Little tweezers. Well, my kids years ago didn't have this. Oh, this? this is for getting earwax. This is earwax. Oh, cool. Oh, that's snazzy. Okay, put that all together. Let's turn the light off. Yeah, save the battery. Never know. She might get a bug in her ear while we're away. Mm -hmm. You find any other good treasures in there? Not much. I'm just not too much. I had these from when John was a baby. I absolutely oh, love the these. Ones. I still have the blue ones. I love those. And Lily got this book. Get to know horse oh. breed. Well, that'll be good reading in the car. Mary, what other kind of cool treasure did you find? Oh, this is for washing their hair. You probably could use it for their fingernails too. That is really. Is this? It a looks suction? like it's a suction cup. Yeah. Oh, <gasps> cool. Well, that's kind of fun, isn't it? I love horses, so that's why I got this book about horses. I think that's good. Yeah, I always have wanted to ride one. You want to ride a horse? Yeah, and I that's why I want them for my farm. Do you know and that your great aunt, which you I don't think you've ever met her, she like had this? miniature ponies when she was a younger person like mommy. Did you know that? I and I rode it when I was a little girl. Really? I did. I'm not did you make like a wild book? No, they're little ponies. She just led it around the little coop. Books. Cool. What else did you find in that? This. I found Babby's. Oh, it's a nail file. That must be the buffing pad. Yes. Yeah, that's can the I, buffing one. I, I think the batteries that? might need a little bit more charging yeah, yeah, before we so put them too. in. I've been working the last couple days trying to get everything planted before we leave. Unfortunately, I did not get everything done. So, and I can't leave. I don't have a garden sitter. 
so I can't leave things in the greenhouse because they'll get too hot in the daytime. So I've moved everything outside to the picnic table under our big tree here. And I'm just hoping, I'm gonna give it a good drink out here. And hopefully by giving them a really big drink of water and in the shade of the tree for the three days, they should be fine. Um, they're saying we may have some rain showers. It's not supposed to add up to a whole lot. So I don't know, I don't have any other choices. I did try to get everything done, but the fact is <laughs> I can't do it all. And I couldn't get that done. So we'll just have to wait until I get home. Daniel, are you excited about going away? No? What about the swimming? Are you excited about swimming? No. The only thing I'm going to leave in here in the greenhouse is the watermelons. They have been okay. They're a little bit bigger pots. I don't know that you can spray these any. Because these are just a few. There we go. Uh-oh, got a big drop of water on the camera. It's raining, guys. Yay! I know it's been really rough for a lot of you guys, the smoke conditions. We're also, as many as you guys know, we're in upstate New York. We are also affected by the smoke in Canada. That's why I'm all stuffed up. Um, hopefully it'll pass in a few days and those fires will go out. Um, but it's been, it's been a struggle. What'd you find? Oh no, a mole hole? Oh, well that mole can stay back here as long as he doesn't come to my garden. He ate my yellow squash a few days ago. Another mole hole. What did you find? <gasps> you found a four leaf clover. Isn't that neat? What was hiding? No, another mole hole. It was a mole hole. Hannah picked the flower for you. Boy, Hannah's practically running. What did you find, Hannah? Oh, you found an dandelion seeds. Can you? I found a red fancy mole. Can you see? <laughs> Careful to see. Whoa, good catch. Ooh, Ooh a clover. Hannah, you want to give it to mommy? Want to give it to mommy? Hannah, give it to mommy. Give it to mommy. Uh -oh. <laughs> I guess you want to well, thank you very much. Thank you. Mommy, I, I stand in by you want it back? Mom, nope. I looked down and I saw a 40 yeah. Wow. Look, Hannah. Are you ready to go away? No. I'm never ready to go away. <laughs> but yes, I am too. Yes, and no. Did you get as far as you wanted with the snail space challenge? Absolutely not. <laughs> you got a lot farther than I thought I would get but not nearly as far as I was hoping. There's just not enough hours in a day, are there?
those are big wheels. That one's not looking too healthy. That looks like it needs restoration. And same with that one over there. Yeah. Can you imagine all the work it would take to restore one of these things? Yeah. That'd be a lot of work. What's your favorite train, Lillian? The blue one. The blue one? Yeah, that is a cool train there. Yeah, I think like the blue one too. Uh huh. A little barrel, Dad. Little what? Barrel. Little barrel. Oh, yeah, there's a little barrel there. Yeah. Oh, that is a function turntable. Can I see a train digger? Come here. Let's go. Oh. We'll, we'll look at a train digger over here. Okay, kiddos, who wants to see a train digger? Okay. Yeah. Oh, a hand cart. I've always wanted to ride on one of those. You think they let me take it out for a spin? Yeah. There's a digger sitting on Thomas. Look, I see a right there. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Happy look. Yeah. Look, look, you might be able to see some strings going to the tin table. Look. Oh, uh -huh. So open. Oh, yeah. yeah. Look, what's this? Yeah. Well, there's another train crane. <gasps> look at that train stairs. <gasps> oh, wow. Look, it's even taller than that. That's so weird. Yeah. Well, let's go around. Maybe there's some more stuff over here. Oh, well, you just hope no one's in front of you. It smells like fireworks in here. Races. So I think these trains backing up days are over. Okay, that one's smoking. I think that one actually still runs. Really? Cool. This rain's always safe. Yeah, there's a guy working in that one. That's funny. I wonder what they're doing with that there. Look at that. They have the little uh, thing on the track sideways. Oh, I bet they hooked it up. I bet it's um, like using the power from that to what? go. I bet it uses the power from the one thing to move. That is interesting. Those those are the tubes that go through the boilers. Oh, like they run I the water through that. those. Yeah. yeah. How does the turntable work, Daniel? This way there's a spider web. And then the wheels are still a Tesla And there are the there's gears a right there. Yeah. It's a really big thing. What am I checking to say? There's a spider web. Yeah, that's a spider web. Uh huh. And they have one train that we can go in. Yeah. The ICRR. Intercontinental Railroad, maybe? Yes. Who wants to be an engineer? Uh-oh. Dad, take a picture called Looking Deep. That's Max's 400 miles per hour. <laughs> no, that's not the speedometer. That's the uh, uh, the pressure, uh, the boiler. Hey, you want to see how much you can see out the front window? Yeah. Yeah, let's see how much you can see out the front. Oh, yeah, you can't see very much uh, scenery in front of you. Sit, you don't sit. You sit. You just keep moving. Well, they might have used to have a seat here. They probably used to sit here. Yeah, probably What's there. What's this? Is this a horn? Just sit down. Yes. Don't pull it. Don't pull it. Yeah. Okay, all I can say is this is not my dream job. <laughs> oh. We got these back here. Oh, let's see what these are here. Windows? Windows open? Oh, no, they don't. Oh, this might be for coal. Wait. To get the coal back. Oh, hey, they no longer use coal. 
They now I use a solar panel to the run the train. Well, the fire used to be in there. Oh. And they'd get it going and that'd create the steam and then the steam would somehow make the wheels turn. I don't know all the details, but I know that's the fire box. Yep, right there. I could never be an engineer. I can't reach it. Daddy. No, you'd have to have a little, you'd have to be an engineer on stills. Who? <laughs> Oh, that'd be funny. Wouldn't that be funny if this oh, horn actually worked? Yeah, try it. Don't. See if it works. Like it. Yeah. Oh. That would be you. <laughs> oh, wow. Could I pull it, Dad? Oh, yeah, you can pull it. Just can we each can just do it twice or once? Can because. Can we just do it all together? Sure. Wait, I want to take a walk. Cool. So yeah, Daniel, try it. They probably put a bell in there so it didn't honk. Can I try? What? See if it stops them. Alright, guys. Come on, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight dogs in the car. Uh, this wheel's not as big. Come on, hurry. Uh, These springs are huge. Wish we could stay longer, but we have to go. Okay, I'm back on the Beast Bus and two, uh, about two and a half more hours. You ready for this? Oh yeah, this will be fun. <laughs> oh, that's right, I gotta get Hannah, <laughs> I gotta get Hannah off my back. She's oh, right. she's grabbing on yeah, your heart. <laughs> she doesn't want to get off, she doesn't want to get back in the van, I don't think. Uh, okay. Okay, you got me. Hey, Epi, you got me. You look like normal fans, Hannah. You have to go first and I'll give you some. We had to strategically place children so that there weren't uh, fights or we not as many are. fights or anything. So that's how we put them in there. Here you go, Hannah, back in your car seat. There's some explosive combinations that we so have to was, avoid. This, this was the age that we traveled with. Um, Charity? Lillian! Lillian. Oh, right, yes. When we first okay. bought the Beast Bus. Hannah opposes the uh -oh. idea. Oh, poor Hannah. She doesn't want to get in. I don't blame you, Hannah. We're only eight miles out. <clears throat> the roadkill of the day is deer. By far. By a lot. Margin. I think we've seen 20 plus. At least. I mean, it's like every couple miles you see another dead deer. I wouldn't think you'd see that many. But. I think I saw a woodchuck though. Yes, I saw a woodchuck. I saw a um, coyote or koi dog. Hannah is trying not to sleep. I think she's almost asleep. Of course, we're almost there. And um, miles. Kids, kids are holding it together as best as can. Hey, that's like where we get our feed. Oops, I forgot to plug in the mic. 